Let's dive in. I am grateful to be pissed off on my own behalf, to be conscious in the 20s, in the 20s, in the 20s, to decolonize the mind. I choose justice. This book is dedicated to anyone's life that I've touched for good or for bad. If you love me, here's to you. If you roll your eyes when you hear my name, I send love your way. Radical gratitude is about acceptance and peace and knowing that there's a whole hell of a lot (laughs) that I do not know. It is about surrender. Surrender means I have the power to lie and breathe. Do not resist that we exist in a binary system for what we resist persists. Good, bad, life, death, down, up, forward, backward, man, woman, day, night, war, harmony, black, white, positive, negative, hate, love, polarity is the natural order of earth. For all that we cannot change, the stimulus, there exists our reaction to it. The response, I choose peace. (sighs) There's a lot of imagery that's still being painted, but I'm here because I want to document all of the painting aspect of it. And I'm recording an up close video on the camera above my phone. So I will be posting that as well. That will kind of show you more of like what's inside of the book. But I wanted to go live because I want to show the process of it all. Hello, Karen. Um, Good morning. I'm just talking about my book. Welcome. Uh, Yes, so the book is called Thank You, Damn It. And it's my radical gratitude journal. So let me go back to reading so you can catch a little glimpse. Extinction, the end. Most books don't start with those words. I'm not most writers. When I was a little girl, before bed, I would ask for story after story for my mom. She would entertain me. She'd go on about a princess named Arena. And she divulged details about how Arena loved to dance and sing and draw and pray. No, I'm Karina, I would reply. Yes, but this is a story about Arena. She would go on. She has eyes that are blue and curly golden hair. There were some nights, though, that my mother of three was too tired and needed to be quick to put us to bed. So on those nights, the bedtime story went like this. Once upon a time, the end. (laughs) Without sounding too morbid or fatalistic, that's life. We're here and then we aren't any longer. And a bunch of messy stuff happens in between. The end. This book is my magnification on all existing forces that be. I blend science, art, spirituality, meditation to better move forward. Jaw army. I'm feeling iry. Iry is a Jamaican patois word that means like I'm feeling good. Um, and I, I like that. So I want to include it. I'll share a couple of more th- a couple of more pages before I head to the beach to paint. It's an act of kindness to share love, an act of suffering to share pain. It is commonly said, hurt people hurt people. We've all seen it ourselves. If you're brave enough to own up to your own ego's actions, you'll admit you've hurt and spewed hurt yourself. I certainly have, but I make the conscious effort each day to end that cycle. And right here is a little bit of blood because I did a water bleed, so I'm gonna return back. I have photos, so I'll I'll write over it, and who knows, maybe I'll rephrase something. But I'm gonna skip this one section. 
Now this one's my one of my favorite pages. So do this with me because this is a great activity to um, kind of become more present in your in your current moment. Put your hand on your own heart, your wrist, your neck at the jawline. When is the last time you drew consciousness to your own pumping flow of life? I ask, what pain resides within you? And what purpose does your ego serve by holding on to that pain? Do you wish it to be gone? It can be. With a groan, let it out. Let it out. Again, the water bleed is here, so I'll go back and contextualize. Do not judge it. Do not accept it as your own. Do not fall victim to it. Do not identify with it, it being pain. You are the observer. You are not your thoughts, your feelings, your circumstances, your goals, your your aspirations, your experiences. You are the one who bears witness to thyself. Good morning, Heidi. (laughs) From here, things get a little bit deeper, so I'm gonna save that for another day. But I just wanted to share a little bit of the process of the book so far. And I'll be posting a video of up close imagery so that you can really see what I'm talking about. But thank you for listening and I hope you guys have a good day. Peace be to you and yours.